welcome back to my channel <laughs> it's your girl Larina and today I am going to be talking to you guys about the time I entered presenter search on three stay tuned <laughs> Bay is about to go behind the scenes. So we're out here. Why did you just record using the back camera? Because. Uh, uh... How are you feeling? This was during my IBS like stage. Like sometimes like stress gets to me and I get irritable bowel syndrome. <laughs> How do you feel about the audition? This is your first edition. Really? But you're gonna win it, right? I don't wanna take it that far. So this was like during that stage where I was feeling really ill, I was feeling sick. I think I'd only had like three hours of sleep that Sunday morning. But I woke up at, I think it was like four, five-ish. Four, four, five. I don't know. But all I know is I had three hours of sleep and I'm feeling sick. I wake up and I'm like, you know what, Larina. Child of God. Why are you sleeping on dreams like this? Not not just one, not just two, not just three. Lots of people have told me before that I would be great on TV or great presenter or whatever. So why are you allowing people to knock on your door so many times before you take them seriously? Fine. Let me go. Let me do this. Okay, okay. Okay, so we're at the stadium. Yep, 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 yep. I'm not feeling well, so excuse my <laughs> out of all days that I could not. Thank you, Google. I like you. You Google. <laughs> That's the director, obviously. That's not just some random guy. Away from the barrier, so it looks a little bit nicer. Get into it nice and cute. Get into it. Because we came here early in the morning, so we're kind of tired and stuff. So I hope she does well. You ready? That's well. We're good. But what's good? Great. Yeah, but what's great? You're not Next quantifying. Stage. Next stage. I don't see that happening. Oh shit. So should we just go home and eat? No, it's for the we came for the experience. The experience. We came What's for the experience? Sunday vibes. Yeah. Well, let's hope. Everything looks like well. See for a bit. So I get my number, I go into the pre-auditions the ones that are not on TV and then I go to the judges where you appear in front of the judges so I get in front of the judges and I realize I haven't really prepared a link so what am I gonna say? tell me something about myself Said, listen, you have 10-15 seconds to do whatever. The thing is, I want you to be, to be real, to be true about yourself. I'm just gonna tell them where I've been. Where? I just, I, I said my link the best that I thought I could. And that was it. That was my, that my 15 seconds was over. And I was literally thinking, oh my gosh, I hope they don't show my face on TV because that was terrible. <laughs> Lit that self-doubt thing. I was like, that was terrible. I Why did I do this? I shouldn't have come. I'm gonna be like one of those like wooden mic type vibes. Oh my goodness, Larina, what are you doing? The Sunday comes, I'm thinking, oh, okay, that's it didn't make it whatever it's okay I tried my best I had fun which I did because I mean guys behind the scenes <laughs> you meet the most incredible people actually like I had fun throughout that entire day so Monday comes nothing uh, Tuesday morning I'm sleeping in okay. I was I will admit it in the morning I should not have been in bed I was wrong 
But anyway, I get a phone call um, and they're like, hi, Larina. Um, so I just wanted to let you know you made the callbacks and I'm like, oh no. <laughs> and the producer goes, oh no. I'm like, oh no. He's like, oh no, what do you mean? I'm like, no, I'm nervous. He's like, nope, it's too late to be nervous now. Uh, so the callbacks are happening, these are the dates, yada yada yada. Boom, done. Next thing you know, it's callback day and uh, they had now narrowed us, uh, narrowed us down to 15 people. So from all the people that were at the stadium, it was now down to 15 people, <sighs> which is a lot. Like that alone, I was like, okay, this is where it ends for me. This has been good, this has been fun. Thank you, thank you, thank you, I'm done. And then you were dressed by Old Khaki, which was really cool, this was the first time I was ever dressed. And, well, <laughs> ever, ever dressed by a stylist. Okay. <laughs> ever like dressed by somebody. Uh, Tabuji was there, I think she's the director, I don't know, she works with Old Khaki. And then Nick was also there, who is, I mean, come on, if you watch SNC, you know who Nick is, he's brilliant. So the fact that they had dressed me kind of gave me a confidence boost um, that, you know, I am looking fly, okay? They're not gonna let me go on there looking some type of way. So I get in there and, like, I don't know how to describe it, y'all. <laughs> Maybe it was the nerves, but that room was dead quiet and so serious i was like geez i feel like i've just walked into a boardroom and i'm about to present like the annual reports or whatever and i don't know there's been some theft in the company and i have to explain it i don't know I, it just it just felt it was a lot um they asked me a lot of questions um a lot of questions a lot of questions or maybe it was the nerves maybe they didn't even ask me that much but my head was just running I did my link and they asked for an impromptu presenting thing and I did that so and then I walked out and I felt like wow you could have done so much more that self-doubt thing again came in I was like that was terrible even when Pabi asked me she was like how did you do or how was it and I was like nah, nah, nah. I just wasn't I, I don't know I was I didn't know I can't say I didn't know what the judges were looking for because I also feel like you can't put on an act for what you think the judges are looking for. It's either you have what they're looking for or you don't. But um, yeah, I felt like no, I have not. Mm. Well, I mean, you definitely um, TV ready. Of course, darling. <laughs>
future office. <laughs> the Afternoon Express Studios. And yeah, we're leaving. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> so yeah, guys. Um, okay, I don't know how I'm gonna edit this video. So I guess I should maybe explain what's happening. So today is the 6th, 6th, 7th of July. I don't know. <laughs> it's the 6th of July. Um, and I got eliminated from presenter search on three. <laughs> Why am I laughing? Uh, thank you so much to everybody that supported me throughout this journey. Uh, yeah, thank you for everyone that supported me. I appreciate the support. I couldn't have asked for better support, honestly. Um, especially considering that I wasn't... Um, what's the word? Like, I didn't have to force it out of you guys, if that makes sense. So, thank you. Um, obviously, this, that won't be the last time you see me on TV. I mean, oh no. <laughs> That will not be the last time you see me on TV being eliminated. I mean, what a way to exit the entertainment industry, right? Um, there are things coming up. Uh, stay tuned. <laughs> Definitely want to stay tuned. Um, you guys know I always have surprises. But yeah, guys, it's been fun. It's been fun. It's been fun, genuinely. Even during the times where it was stressful, I guess it's because of the people around me. I was just always having some sort of fun. Whether it's because we're laughing because we've been scolded for making noise. I mean, that, I know that sounds bad, but you know, can't control the crowd sometimes, right? Um, or, you know, just, it's been fun. It's been to summarize my journey on Presenter Search on 3. It's been amazing. Uh, just to wrap it all up, um, all I can say is SABC3 does say the stage is yours. The stage is mine, no matter where it is that it's situated. So <laughs> if you want me to MC at your weddings, let me know. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, I'm not kidding. But <laughs> the stage is mine. The world is mine, is my oyster. Sometimes, sometimes you spend your time worrying about things when you, you're trying to make sense of a half circle. A full circle is going to form and all of this is going to make sense. So I would like to thank the judges, Patience Stevens, Mrs. Okumalo, DJ Fresh and Jeannie D for believing in me to become, you know, to get into top 10 because I know that's going to open a lot of doors for me. I would like to thank the crew, <laughs> Mikal, Lars, Davi, Lucky, Sam. Okay, I can't, okay, this is going to be a whole video now of thanking people, but basically, Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate everything that you guys taught me behind the scenes. Um, Etienne, even. Uh, Vimpi okay, stop with the lists, okay? <laughs> Basically, I would like to thank everybody that support. Oh, most importantly, thank you. Thank you, Yusufi, Budi, uh, Auntie, Mama, Dada. Thank you for your support. I, I, I mean, it's been amazing, guys. It's been amazing. But yeah, I bow down, bow out gracefully, babes. <laughs>
opportunity and I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and share this video to let people know what the behind the scenes of presenter search on three looks like. <laughs> I know I just put on a presenter voice there because like irony, but whatever. <laughs> Bye.